Hey guys, I'm gonna do a quick video on how to use the Mosier measuring device in conjunction with the Message Square mobile app for the iPad. Also, will work for your phone. Before you start this, make sure you have an active subscription with Measure Square, and you'll also need an active subscription with the Mosier 3D um, subscription within their app. So that uh, enables the API integration for to work. And of course, you need your Mosier device. Make sure you've already paired this with the uh, device itself, so the iPad or the iPhone. And essentially, if you know how to use the Mosier measuring system already, you'll know how to do this. So it's pretty straightforward. I'm gonna do a very simple measurement just so you can see the emotions um, of how to do this. So I'm gonna set down my phone real quick, double tap the Mosier device to get it activated as it usually doesn't work if it's just sitting there. So you get that double tap, lights up blue. So now it's gonna be connected to the device automatically. Nothing extra we have to do. I'm gonna tap on tools, tap on the distance meter at the bottom, scroll down if you don't see it, tap on the Mosier measure space beta. This will launch the app. You'll see it's connecting and it says place to start. So I'm gonna move this to the corner over here. And once it's green, good to go. So now I can just move this to the corner. Sorry for the mess. And there'll be sounds that make this really easy on the measuring app uh, for the Mosier app. So it can give you actually visual indications of when you need to pick this up and move. And you have that visual going too. So it's quite easy for me to do this. Um, if, you, if I didn't have the headphones, you'd be able to hear it. So I did my shape. So now I'm done. So what we can do is hit finish measurement. And now you'll notice that I can say return. That's gonna shoot us back to measure square. But in case I didn't close the shape, um, perfectly what we want to do is tap this gear right here and this will give us some specific options that work with measure square so it's all automatically closed my shape but if it did not and i want to make sure my starting and end point um, are connected which we definitely need to do because we need this to be a complete enclosed shape there can't be a gap um, in there so where it says undo join uh, start slash finish points it would say the opposite you can tap that to finish it off uh, square up, we'll, um, it will see if this is supposed to be a perfect square rectangle and it's close enough. It will kind of square off each corner for you. If you don't want to do that, if it is an odd shape slightly, you can undo that as well. So once this is done, I can hit cancel since so it's already automatically done that for me. There are some settings in the Mosier app to handle that. So once I'm done here, tap return. And you'll see how it takes us back into Measure Square Mobile. And I can zoom in here and you can see my very small room. So again, this is just my desk, but pretty easy to do um, if you're doing more complicated shapes. It's the exact same workflow. You don't need to use a different uh, measurement method at this point to uh, get those done. So quite easy. Um, we'll be coming up with more content as this uh, integration um, is continuing. So we'll, um, please uh, follow our YouTube channel and we'll get more content up there. Thank you.